Swala la uagizaji wa mahindi kutoka nchi za kigeni kiendelea kuwa moto. Viongozi kutoka eneo la bonde la Ufa wameendelea kuikosoa serikali kufuatia matamshi ya waziri wa viwanda Moses Kuria kuwa serikali taruhusu uagizaji wa gunia milioni kumi za mahindi. There is a deliberate move to continue killing the maize farm in this country as was seen in the previous regime where even the sugar sector and other farms farming sectors were killed. And I want to tell uh, the minister that at least we are more than 45 members of parliament. We speak on behalf of millions of farmers. We may be few, but the voices that are behind us, the prayers that are behind us, the wishes and the hope that the Kenyans put in us, those of us who are here and some are not here, I'm sure we will go to mount a force that will ensure no GMO of maize will be imported in this country. Wakiongozwa na seneta wa Nandi Samson Cherargei, wabunge hao wamesema kuwa hatua hiyo ya kuagiza mahindi tawaharibia kulima wa humu nchini bei ya mahindi ikizingatiwa kuwa msimu wa kuvuna walichopanda wa kulima hao umewadia. The committees of agriculture, trade and industry and cooperatives in Parliament should immediately summon the CS of trade on Rebo Moses Korea and CS agriculture on Rebo Mithika Lenturi on the matter. Furthermore, the ministry should cease, should cease the issuance of gazette notice to allow importation of 10 million duty-free yes. bags or any other amount of maize into the country. We also demand the government to open national cereals and produce board and strategic grain reserves and mop up the entire maize harvest of this year before allowing importation of any amount of, of maize. Viongozi hao wakitilia shaka nia ya uagizaji wa mahindi hiyo wakisema kuwa hamna haja ya kuagiza mahindi wote wakitaka wizara ya kilimo kwanza kununua mahindi kutoka kwa wakulima wa humu nchini na kuzihifadhi katika magala ya NCPB na kishaye kuagiza mahindi wapo kuna haja. Tumeona wale makateli pia wameanza kujipanga kuleta mahindi ambayo ni gushi na kilimo ya mahindi hii Kenya itakufa. Na mimi ni muulize mheshimiwa waziri Kuria kwamba yeye eh, si mbunge wa Katundu ile ya zamani tena ni waziri awache kutoa matamshi ambayo tunaita kwa kizungu reckless because those are completely reckless statements that can only come from a person who is coming from a bar not a person coming from a government minister and uh, what we, uh, we we want to tell the rest of the country that we are a responsible government we are a government that will listen to the people and the people of Kenya are saying no to importation of uh, GMO, no to importation of, uh, of, of maize because we have enough maize in this country. Awali kuliibuka mihemko baada ya kudaiwa kuwa kuna meli lilokuwa limebeba mahindi limetia nanga katika bandari ya Mombasa iliyoagizwa na serikali lakini madai hayo yalikosolewa ikisemekana kuwa mahindi hiyo ni ya shirika la chakulu limwenguni WFP.